Good morning, world, all nations, all people, all tongue. Good morning to every man, woman, boy, and girl living and breathing in the face of this earth. Please click the bell and subscribe. Thank you for viewing these videos. Thank you for subscribing. I thank God for blessing these videos to reach across the face of this earth and all over the world. John 3, 16, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. Here is a fresh drink of water for you from the Holy Spirit. Enjoy! I will be reading from the King James Version of the Bible, and our topic today is clarity. Isaiah 9, 19. Through the wrath of the Lord of hosts is the land darkened, and the people shall be as fuel of the fire. No man shall spare his brother. This is written before the birth of Jesus Christ, our salvation, our Savior. Jesus' blood cleansed us from all unrighteousness. It's from all unrighteousness that we will not attack our brothers and sisters in Christ. We will control our anger and through the word of God give over all situations to Jesus Christ. He said, cast all your cares on me. When someone has hurt you, cast that care over to Jesus. Talk to him about it. Talk with him about it as if you're talking to a friend and then leave it there with him. And don't bring it up. Every time the enemy bring it to your mind, just say, tell the devil, I've given that to Jesus already and he's taking care of it. Today, the devil is here to kill, to steal, kill, and destroy. He can't kill and destroy until he steal the word of God from the body of Christ, from those of us that belong to Jesus Christ. How can he steal the word? Because Christians are not opening up their Bible and reading the word. Sometimes when you set your mind to read the word, he'll throw a distraction there. And you never get to the place of reading the word. You want to read the word in the morning and the devil will distract you. And it didn't happen. You didn't get to read the word. He stole the word. This is the last days. So much evil, violence are in some places and at an all-time high. Fires and storms, diseases, and other evil plagues in the earth. The devil wants to steal the word of God from us. Then he can kill and destroy but for as long as we're in the word and reading the Bible, we have to read the Bible. This is, is so vital to our relationship and our spiritual growth. <laughs> because without reading the Bible, there is no spiritual growth. You can't leave everything to the preacher. This is why we have to ask the Lord Jesus Christ, the Father in the name of Jesus, what church do you want me to go to? Lead and guide me. Show me. What church home that you would have me to go to so that I can grow. It is so important for the body of Jesus Christ to read the Bible, apply his word to our everyday life, have Bible study with your children, join a church home because your children is going to ask you questions as you have Bible study with them. And you want to be able to answer the questions honestly and truthfully as possible according to the word of God. Children, the children are our future. They will lead the way. We have to give them the tools, the ammunition, because the devil is defeated by the power of Jesus Christ. Thank you for listening. God bless. Have a wonderful day.